has to come forward as well. There he is. Looks very relaxed with the last couple. Coming forward, let's head back up to Mike Catamull for the big one at the Howard Wright Doncaster Cup. Alex, thank you. A privilege to call this one, remembering Howard, proud son of Doncaster. Trushan the last in as he tries to defend his title. They're off and racing. And Wise Eagle and Sweet William were a little bit slow to try. Sweet William perhaps not as as desired as much as uh, Wise Eagle, who's uh, normally dropped in. Sweet William recovering up the inside there, though. Then the two and a quarter mile trip ahead of them, the Betfred Howard Wright Doncaster Cup. Group two, remembering Howard, a proud son of Doncaster. Gregory out in front then, taking the long past the enclosures here with last year's winner, Trushan, on the inside and the 2022 winner, Coltrane, racing in third and recovering after a slightly tardy start. Sweet William in the pink jacket, ahead then of Point Lonsdale and Wise Eagle at the back of the field in the red colours in the hands of Danny Tudho. They're moving past the St. Ledger start as they head away from the grandstands here and the pace looks a pretty reasonable one and Trushan in fact has come through now to, to lead he's become a little bit more adaptable with his tactics in his more recent outings so Holly Doll has taken over from namesake James on the outside who's content to get a lead on Gregory Coltrane is right behind them in third in the hands of Oshin Murphy Rab Havlin has now got Sweet William having been on the rail he's been switched out into fourth place away now from the others and then Point Lonsdale's white face and Ryan Moore in the Derek Smith purple jacket is next. Wise Eagle, the outsider of the sextet, looking on as they move on uh, towards the turnover on the far side of the race course here with about five lengths between first and last. They're about to complete the first mile of the Betfred Howard Wright Doncaster Cup Group 2 and Trushan is in front then as they swing left-handed. From Gregory in second, Coltrane and neck down in third, followed then by... Sweet William, just getting a little bit of a slap down the shoulder there from Rab Havlin. They're past the halfway point now in the Doncaster Cup. Two legs away fifth, then is Point Lonsdale, who's just squeezed along there briefly by Ryan and looking on, travelling well. Wise Eagle, the outsider, in the red jacket as they move now inside the final seven furlongs of the contest here. Trushan being held together by Holly in front and leading from Gregory. On the inside is Coltrane, Sweet William, second in the Goodwood Cup, third in the Gold Cup, is racing in fourth. He's favourite today. Can he get this coveted prize on his CV? Next comes Point Lonsdale, and then still travelling well, Wise Eagle. All six of these runners are going very nicely indeed as they swing now and move down towards the run, which will bring them towards the turn into the home straight. They've got about five and a half furlongs left to run now and still all six travelling well within themselves. Trushan in front as they come into view from the grandstands end as they approach the last four and a half furlongs and straighten up for the judge from Gregory on the outside in the red cap and then Coltrane in the sheepskin noseband. Sweet Williams still travelling well. Point Lonsdale in there pitching as well. And Wise Eagle, nothing much has happened yet as they come down the home straight. The final three furlongs approaching for this historic running of the Doncaster Cup. And still Trushan is in front and still travelling strongly. Now Sweet William has emerged out of the pack. He's now trying to chase down the Trushan with a quarter of a mile to go. And Sweet William finds an extra gear here and goes past Trushan. Trushan, a furlong and a half left to go, Sweet William from Trushan, Point Lonsdale is trying to challenge on the outside with Coltrane, well held is Gregory, but it's Sweet William the favourite who's in terrific form today, leading by three lengths as he races inside the closing stages, Trushan though is beginning to rally and trying to close down the gap, but Sweet William will hold him off and win the Howard Wright bet at the Doncaster Cup here, Trushan an honourable second, Point Lonsdale and then Coltrane. Train next. It's third past the line. Well, there you go. It's Sweet William, the favourite, who is a better horse than he was last year. But Jamie, I think he's also maybe a wiser horse than he was yeah, last year. He's wise, he's cute, and he is best of the rest outside of Kiprios and Trollerman as far as British and Irish days are concerned. I think he's confirmed that today, but there is still that quirk and the flaw and foible which stop you short of thinking he can go against the big boys yet. Yeah, it was his opportunity today, Jim. His price reflected that. It didn't make life that easy. Easy though for Rab Havlin. No, he didn't, and he's 